Hello YouTube. This is the Hartwood Farmer. I wanted to show you how we grow potatoes. Um, we grow them in sacks rather than in the ground. Just because our garden is full of other things. Um, and potatoes are not a high, a high cash value crop. But we do grow a few for the harvest baskets that we sell. Um, and we grow them in sacks. So you can see that this is just a, it's a big, it's called a super sack. It's uh, three feet by three feet square on the bottom. It's four feet tall. And uh, we plant our potatoes in there. Um, so this is a mix. Uh, it just rained last night, so it's a little bit wet, I guess. But this is a mix of um, horse, horse stall bedding uh, and horse manure. Uh, there's sand in there. Uh, a little bit of garden soil, uh, just, you know, the clay dirt we dug out of the garden and mixed in. Uh, and a little bit of chicken manure, too, for good measure. Uh, mixed up, filled in the sack. Uh, and I'll show you in another sack that I'm going to plant today. Uh, we just start with a layer of soil, plant the potatoes, and then these vines grow up. The, the potatoes... Uh, sprout it makes vines with leaves and as the vines grow up uh, we bury them until just the tops are sticking out again and we just keep doing that until the sack and then adding more dirt and adding more dirt until the sack is full of potatoes from top to bottom so let me show you how we start that process over here So here's another super sack. So it starts out with roughly six inches of growing medium in it. Uh, sand, manure, clay from the garden, horse, horse stall bedding. Um, this one doesn't have any chicken manure in it because I didn't have any handy. Uh, but it's all kind of spread out there as even as, as evenly as I could get it, which isn't very even, but that's okay. And we've got our seed potatoes. Um, see, the seed potatoes have an eye, and this was a bigger potato that I cut um, so that I could get more uh, more potato vines going. And uh, it's real easy. You just set your potato down in the dirt don't cover it up yet because you want to be able to see where you've planted them and you want to space them sort of apart from each other uh, spacing's not critical but you want the eyes to point up that's kind of important I think uh, because the eye of the potato is where the vine's going to grow out of and I just kind of Put some in here and there. Now, if if they didn't have so much vertical space to grow in, I'd be more more worried about the horizontal spacing. Um, but as it is, I think they're going to be hard pressed to be crowded because um, they can always grow up. You've got four feet to grow up before they run out of sack. You want to kind of just keep them, you know, a little bit toward the edges is okay. You don't want it right on the edge. You want the potatoes to be surrounded in dirt. And I've got more seeds than I have space in this sack. And I got a yucky potato. You don't want to plant that. <clears throat> There's a couple more good ones. You can see I just have the potatoes distributed around in a not particularly even fashion, but that's okay. Like I said, they're potatoes. Potatoes never measured anything. If you don't get your measurements right, it doesn't matter. They'll grow. And we'll put one more. I already have one more. 
I'm just gonna put one more over there, but uh, I don't know. I'll put that one there. <clears throat> and I'll move this one over here. There we go. Move that one back a little. All right, and then uh, now that I've got them all in there, uh, I'll go get a, a dirt and I'll put, I don't know, three inches of dirt on top of them. Uh, it, yeah, I'm sorry, I say dirt, but it's not dirt. It's this mix uh, that we have. Now, if you don't have access to a horse stall, there's a horse farmer down the road from me that'll fill my pickup truck uh, full of manure uh, for 10 bucks. It's a pretty good deal. There's a couple thousand pounds of manure for ten dollars is, is not too bad. Um, but and then we of course we've got the chickens over there that make our chicken manure. If you don't have access to manure like that, uh, you can go to the store, buy potting soil and buy uh, different fertilizers to mix in. We don't need to do that, fortunately. So what I'm going to do is uh, I happen to have a sack right there with some manure in it. There's nothing planted in it yet, so I'm going to uh, rob some dirt out of it to cover my potatoes with, and um, we'll see what happens. So theoretically, in a week or two, I don't know, maybe a little longer, little green shoots will be sticking up above this first layer of dirt that I'm going to put down now, uh, and then we'll cover that, and uh, I'll make a video of that part. So, uh, I'll see you in a couple of weeks, three weeks maybe. We'll check on the potatoes. Take care.